breaking news on Indy's near northeast side. We've confirmed with Metro Police that three people have been shot. Lindsay Stone has more. Lindsay? Well, good morning. In just the last half hour or so, we were able to speak to IMPD, and they told us that this scene is very active. They are beginning to piece together what exactly happened here. Now, we have learned those two people who died were both men. The third person that was shot was also a man. That person is in critical condition and has been transported to a nearby hospital. Now, as you can take a look behind me, you can see this is still a very active crime scene. All of this taking place in what's believed to be the silver minivan just beyond those police lights. That's where we've seen investigators working, taking photos as you're seeing that in live pictures. I've also seen officers and investigators speaking to neighbors, people in the area about what they think happened here, trying to get more information. At this point, the identity of those three people involved have not yet been released or their ages. We just know that they are three men involved. And again, two of those men have died, one still in critical condition. Now, we did ask officers if if the area is safe. They say there's no immediate threat to the area, but we also asked about a shooting, that hap a shooting that happened overnight less than two miles away, just about a mile and a half from here. There was a shooting overnight at 2502 North Sherman Drive. Investigators couldn't say whether they knew that these two events were connected, but it is part of their ongoing investigation. Now, of course, we're going to be out here all morning bringing you more updates. We'll keep you up to date both on air and online at fox59.com. Here on the east side, Lindsay Stone, Fox 59 News.